Hey guys, today we're going to install a Joomla extension called Foca Gallery. And what it is, it's, it's, a, it's a really great image gallery plugin, um, excuse me, component for Joomla. Um, it's my personal favorite. It has a lot of options. It has a lot of, it has a lot of third party plugins as well. It has slideshows, um, download plugins, all types of stuff. So you want to go to foca.cz and go to components and Foca gallery and you just want to click download and you want to download we are going to be using a 2.5 Joomla site so you want to download that and then we're going to go over to our Joomla site which is a brand new installation uh, it hasn't been touched at all and this is the back end and we're going to install it just like any other extension go to extension manager choose file and we want to just upload that component zip file okay and now you want to click install and we get a we have a bunch of um, warnings here. Let me reload. I'm not sure why we're having those. Uh, we are using a local installation. This isn't on a, an actual web server. It's on a Zamp server. Um, they just look like warnings. So I'm just going to ignore these for now because I'm not sure why it's happening, but anyways we're just going to ignore that so we want to go to we want to create a category actually you know what None. Let's see if that helps at all all right yeah so that just I just got rid of the warnings I changed the uh, error reporting setting so we want to go to categories and we want to create a new category and I'm just going to say, I don't know, my picks. And you can choose a parent category if you want it. Um, access rights, I'm going to choose all. Upload rights, super user. Delete rights, super user. And the owner, we can just leave. Now, another, the last required thing for us to do in this, in creating a category, is to create a folder. So we want to click select folder and we want to create a new folder for, for every category that we create. We should create a folder. And you just want to click this little arrow, okay, and that inserts it here. So remember, every category needs its own folder. And that's all. We could put a description, but we're not going to do that. So I'm just going to click save and close. All right, so now we have a, a category. Alright, so images, we have a couple options. We can upload single images or multiple. Uh, I'm going to first do a single image. So I'm just going to click New. And the title will just be My Image, Category, My Picks, File Name. Um, this is where we upload the actual image. So we want to use this uploader right here by clicking choose file and um, let's see, I'm just going to do just going to upload a stock photo, uh, 3D figures, I'll use this guy and then click start upload. So now it's uploaded, this is our image. We want to click this arrow here to insert it into the file name field. And that's really all we need. That's all we need, but we, you could add more stuff here. Titles and um, zoom, a whole bunch of stuff, description. But we're just going to keep it as is and click save and close. And it will generate, it just generated a thumbnail on that screen you just saw. So now we have my image in the my picks category now I'm going to show you how to actually display it so you want to go you want to create a new menu item I'm going to use my top menu click menu item and you want to select Foca gallery and I'm going to do a 
I'm just going to choose this list of images category view. What that will do is show all the images in a certain category. And I'm going to choose my picks over here. And I'll just give it a name of images. And then you could edit certain options here. I'm just going to leave it as is. Uh, save and close. Oh, we can't use images as an alias. So we're just going to say my images because images is an actual folder in a Joomla installation. So we can't have that as the link name. So my images. Whoop, I hit the category wasn't selected. One second. Uh, where would it? Top menu, images. I just didn't did that didn't select the my picks category. So save and close. Let's go to our front end and reload. Now we have an images link, and here's our gallery. Any other images we add will be displayed here. And you get a nice full image here. If you have more, you can have like a little slideshow type deal. And we have downloads enabled, so the user can actually download this image. But we can, of course, we can, you know, take that away if we want. So that's it. I mean, it's installed. And actually, you know what? I'm going to show you one more thing. I'm going to show you how to upload multiple images. So we want to go back to images. And we're going to click this multiple add. Okay. Now what we want to do is we want to use this multiple upload tab. And we want to let's select the my picks category from here and here. Add images. Now let's just choose three images. Okay, now we just click start upload. And take a couple seconds. Okay. And I'm just going to select the My Picks again. I don't know why it clears it out, but it does. Oh, you know what? These here were supposed to go in this folder. I guess I was supposed to go into that folder before the upload. But I'm pretty sure I can do this by checking these and choosing the category here. So let's see. It generates the thumbnails. Okay, yep, yeah, so they're all in the My Picks category. So if we go back to the front end, reload, and there's our images. So of course you can customize the gallery. We can make these bigger or smaller or change the background or all types of things. But this is the basic, um, the basic way you would create a photo gallery on Joomla using Foca.